What's up guys, it's Patrick here. And in this video, I'm gonna be going over how to get teeth fast in Awakening. Um, I've had a lot of people asking me how to get this um, with the new armory upgrades and all that stuff, people wanting to just get as many teeth as possible. And uh, I thought I could probably help you guys out on this. It's uh, it's different than from my previous guides. Like. Uh, since I released teeth, I've made a couple videos on how to get them, uh, just because it's such a topic that people are really interested in, and people really want to get their teeth, uh, which is definitely understandable. So I thought I'd make a video for Awakening uh, that will kind of show you the best way to get teeth on this map. So what I recommend is, I'll, uh, first I'll look at Mayday. When Mayday first came out, I told people, um, if you're just trying to go for base, basically like as fast as possible, the best way to do it was through the bonus pool because it would only take seven minutes um, to get to the tentacle, beat it, and then you would beat that hive, and then you would actually get a tooth. But on this map, you have to get to the first door and break it down um, using the Vanguard. And that probably takes 15 minutes. Uh, so it, it takes a lot longer. Now I do recognize you only get three from your bonus pool as well. So it's not definitely not your most viable option uh, of getting teeth fast in this map. Uh, I wouldn't recommend it really. It's it just, it's not that it's, it's bad, but it, it may take quite a while. And um, like I said, I just don't really recommend it. So the bonus pool is not your most viable way of getting lots of teeth on Awakening. Um, and what I recommend actually your best your best way of going about doing it is simply playing solo. You're going to see how many kills I get at the end of this map. Um, this is my very first time playing, so I really don't know what I'm doing very much, and I don't know where anything is, and I think my sentry gun, gun even glitched out. But I get a lot of kills for my first game, only making it to, I think, the seventh obelisk, or maybe the sixth. Um, I'm on the sixth right now. So really, guys, like I'm saying... The best way to get teeth on this map is just straight through uh, playing solo. And it's, it's a, solo is definitely harder than co-op, but you get so many more kills because you're not being carried by your team. You're just playing by yourself. You know, you can get your sentries up. Those will get you lots of kills if you can get two sentries at once. Um, and like an engineer upgrade to use the traps. You get so many kills playing that way. I mean, if you're good enough of a player, you can w run one relic and you'll get an extra teeth when you beat it. Uh, but like I said, I think a lot of people will be having some trouble with this map at the beginning on solo. So you may not want to run a relic. You may just want to go for solo and then just try to beat the map as many times as you can. You'll get two teeth that way. Because um, I, I imagine you can probably get 600, kill, 600 t uh, kills a game, which will get you one tooth. So really, guys, there's no... I, I, I want to be honest with you. Like, there's no foolproof way of getting teeth. Like, there's no hack or anything or, or just wait, like, exploit in the game on Awakening, which is kind of unfortunate. Some people are a little sad about that. But really, um, I'm just being honest with you guys and letting you know. The best way I've found to get teeth is just going straight, um, just using your sentries, your traps, and uh, just playing solo because you get so many more kills. Like, I'm not even halfway through, and I think I end up with like 270 kills maybe, which is really good. Like sometimes uh, a game of like normal zombies you'll get, or sorry, a game of normal extinction, you'll get 270 the whole map. And, and I got like this map much, my very first try, not even halfway through. So it's really, really helpful. And um, I think that you guys will definitely have uh, the most success running this strategy, which is really not even a strategy, but it's just I'm recommending go solo because you'll get more kills, um, which I think you can see here in just a second, actually. Yeah, 263 kills. Um, and I only made it to my seventh hive just at the beginning. So like if you just go solo running that, um, I really think that that is your best option for getting teeth. Uh, you may want to not run a relic if you're not the best player. But if you do run a relic, like I said, you'll get you'll get three a game. And uh, it's, I mean, three games, pretty good. It's supposed to be probably like three in an hour, which I, I mean, if I can get three teeth an hour, that's a pretty good, pretty good amount. Uh, plus your bonus pool if you do happen to have it. But anyways, guys, I hope you found that video helpful. I know, like I said, there's no foolproof way of going at this. So uh, there you go. You see my round 11, uh, my, my rank 11 leaderboard, which I was pretty proud of this morning. But uh, hopefully you guys found that video helpful. If you could leave a like, that would be great. If you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe for a whole bunch more Awakening videos. And uh, I'll talk to you soon. Bye, guys.